Coast to Coast, direct from Austin. You're listening to the Alex Jones Broadcasting Network. Network. Big Brother. Mainstream media. Government cover-ups. You want answers? Well, so does he. He's Alex Jones on the GCN Radio Network. And now, live from Austin, Texas, Alex Jones. Welcome back to the Alex Jones Show. I'm David Knight, and in overdrive, we're going to try to get to some of the people that have been waiting for a very long time. I don't know if we can make it through. We're going to try to go through these calls quickly. We've got at least five people I want to try to get a hold of. Tack, Frank, Uncle John, JD, and Mike. So, guys, hang on. We're going to try to get through this segment and get your calls, but let's go very quickly. Tack in California, go ahead. Hello? Hello, Tack. Go ahead. you got the floor. Go ahead. Hey, David. Real quickly, I see this. Oh, we only have one hope and one hope only to save America, and that's next November. We need to vote out in vote in an all new Congress and an all new Senate, and the people need to start volunteering. And one person go to each voting voting polling place and take an in poll data, and that way, if they get a good idea, if the machines are rigging, because we all know the machines are rigged. Oh yeah, oh and yeah. That, that way, we'll be able to compare the votes that actually took place. To the, to the so-called results, and we'll know if there's fraud and we can stop it. But we can't, we got, Alex needs to put emphasis on getting people out to register to vote out the Congress and the Senate, because if we don't get a new Congress, a new Senate, we, we don't have a chance. That's the way I see it. You know? I agree, I agree. That's a start. There's a lot of things that we can do, and we can do things at the local level as well. There's a lot of corruption in the uh, electoral system, and we need to find better ways to monitor that. One thing that we can all do, let's not forget, jury nullification. We've got to get our right to trial by jury back, and we need people to stand up for justice and not just be rubber stamps for the judges. Thank you, Tack in California. Let's go to Frank in North Carolina. Go ahead, Frank. Yeah, I just wanted to uh, tell people about something I heard yesterday uh, on the radio and as regards in regards to the um, Bundy uh, situation. Uh, I listened to Rush Limbaugh for about 15 years, uh, every chance I could get. I mean, I'd eat, I'd eat my lunch in the car when it was 90 degrees outside. I did that all through college, every, everything. But uh, I, I woke up uh, back in 2005, 2006 and realized that Rush Limbaugh was a sellout. And uh, in it for the money, and probably, probably uh, you know, whoring himself out for the establishment uh, false left right paradigm. But uh, he had on a uh, guest host yesterday, and I just happened to be in a car where they were playing that. Uh, this guy, I believe his name is Mike or Mark Stein. I believe he's a Canadian. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He started talking about the, this Bundy situation. I couldn't believe it. He sounded like Alex Jones, and he said basically anybody that doesn't understand what's going on and doesn't support the Bundys ought to be ashamed of. of themselves. And I'm going to tell you that Glenn Beck, he's one part snake, one part weasel, one part rat, 100% creep. He's oddly effeminate, like <laughs> Harry Reid and Lindsey Graham. And uh, poor Mr. Bundy doesn't understand. But uh, people like Beck, Beck is is, is a pr the proverb proverbial wolf in sheep's clothing. He doesn't care anything about this country. Well, I think you're right. Now, I, I didn't hear Mark Stein, but I, if he's talking about uh, it being a police state issue, uh, this is something that ought to ought to unite people across the political spectrum. And I tell you, when they start trying to divide people along these different demographic groups and, and uh, put a, pit us against each other, that is strictly a control technique. The bigger picture, of course, there's a lot of things behind it. Agenda 21, the corruption and ethics issues behind Harry Reid, but it's also about the police state issue here. That is something that ought, ought to unite everybody, left and right. Thank you, Frank, in North Carolina. Let's go to uh, Uncle John in Pennsylvania. Hello, David. Hey. Hats off to all you uh, frontline info warriors. <laughs> Go ahead. What's on your mind? Thank you. What's all on your right. Mind? I was listening to Michael Savage Wednesday, mm -hmm. and he he said something that uh, I'm surprised Alex didn't mention earlier. And there's a rare earth mine near the Bundy Ranch, like 150 miles. Oh yeah, absolutely. And it's not so much what's underground and and solar and wind. But perhaps they're after all those rare minerals as well. You know, there's a lot of different things there. There's mineral rights, there's surface rights. All of this, there's two things going on behind this, and that is the effort to get people off the land as part of Agenda 21. And it's also looting the country and turning it over to the Chinese and other giant corporations. And there's many different ways they can do it. Neil Cornza. 
who is now the director of the BLM, who used to work for Harry Reid. His father was very involved in very many mining companies, as somebody pointed out earlier. Sorry I couldn't get to the last two guys there. Thank you so much for your calls. We'll be back on Sunday. There's going to be a special program that Alex has recorded. Join us then. From the water table to our soils to the atmosphere itself, our world is becoming more and more toxic each and every day. But it's not just the air outside that's toxic. Indoor air has been shown to have two to five times higher concentrations of pollutants than even outdoor air. Level by top doctors, nutritionists, pharmacists, and others. We have developed what I believe is the ultimate non-GMO organic super male vitality formula sourced from powerful organic herbs and then concentrated for maximum potency super male vitality was developed to activate your body's own natural processes instead of using synthetic chemicals super male vitality by infowars life is so powerful that i only take half the recommended dose for a limited time we are offering 15 percent off super male vitality at infowarslife.com to introduce you to this powerful supplement visit infowarslife.com today to secure your super male vitality infowarslife.com a chemical spill contaminating the water supply in nine West Virginia counties. This year alone, over 300,000 people in West Virginia had their drinking water contaminated. What are the health effects of having these drugs in our drinking water? It's forced medical treatment without the consent of residents. My friends, water filtration is one of the most basic actions you can take to protect you and your family from the harmful toxins and heavy metals in your tap water. On average.